Hi guys, I'm Hedges Kitty, and I'm going to be talking about Outlast 2 in a, in a short time period, um, the trailer for it will play, and I'm going to try to explain a little bit through it, but Outlast 2 is an okay game. Now there are spoilers, so beware. Okay, this is Jessica, and she went to school with the main character. I forgot his name. I apologize. Um, she was murdered by the preacher or principal, whatever, and made look to be suicide. That picture of him will show up in just a moment. But part of this game gets me a little confused because he's like in and out of hallucinating. He's in back and forth grade, which okay, that could be be kind of cool, but. The location-wise doesn't make sense with the, all the enemies and crap. You don't really run into them. In the, in this, it, it's okay, I would say. But the location-wise and enemies, I don't really get because it doesn't make personal a lot of sense to me. But that's me. Then you have the, these Christians, if you can say that, they murdered children thinking they'd be the Antichrist. And any newly pregnant mother, they would murder them, thinking it's the Antichrist. Then you have the weird cult, you know, the heretics. That's a whole nother story. <laughs> but, um, the dude's wife, again, I apologize, I forgot her name. Lynn is her name. She is pregnant with their child. What I do not get, in the beginning of the game... She doesn't even look pregnant whatsoever. And for a belly to swell up, that takes at least a, f a while. I Nothing like expands that fast in that short period. Now, why was she pregnant? And I understand, okay, maybe childbirth and death. I'll explain this guy in a sec, but I don't really know why she would be pregnant and give birth, blah, 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 blah. And for this guy, he was a butt. Personally, when I first saw that little guy on his back, I thought, oh, he's just a kid that got badly injured and can't use his legs. No, that's a grown man, because I heard his voice. Shoots freaking flaming arrows at you, that's a bullcrap thing. And then, back to Lynn. I know, I'm, I'm jumping back and forth. Sorry. Sorry. But again, and then, what's with her attire? Okay, I see maybe the heretic's giving her a new outfit because she's pregnant. But, they couldn't have been there more than two days, top. Because Ethan slept like one night, and you can't go 
nine months without sleeping. Like, when you look at her, like, full-on view from the beginning, as you saw from the trailer, girl don't look pregnant. And I'm saying, I'm not being rude, but there'd be at least a small belly bump. Most likely. And just how the ending goes, where the pasture comes to you, oh, kill the child and all blah blah blah. There has to be an apocalypse crap going on because, well, freaking blood rain, you know, all that crazy shit. Excuse my cuss. But Outlast 2, in my opinion, wasn't the very best. It could have been done better. It, I feel like they rushed through it a lot more than they should have. Because they're going through Lynn's all, you know, pregnancy and stuff. I'm just like, ugh. But as I was saying about this game, if I had to rate this from 1 to 10, 1 being my worst, 10 being the best, I would give it maybe a 3.5. This game had so much potential, but the creators screwed it by rushing through that thing so much. This, it, there's no jump scares, there's no real horror. You get frustrated finding some of these daggum frickin' enemies. I'm just like, oh my goodness, what did they do? The first Outlast was so good. I remember actually watching some YouTubers play because I didn't get a copy of it, but whatever. Didn't feel like pain. But I watched it, it was like such a great game. What the crap did they do to Outlast 2? I'm waiting for like the DLC to come out to show of what they fixed and maybe continue the story plot. It's just incredible what they did to this poor game. But other than me complaining that the game isn't the best, I really did love the art style. It was pretty good. But I do have questions for like that ending because they leave you with the baby, then they go with the hallucination again. You see Jessica one more time. She does a quick prayer. She's got strangle marks on her freaking neck. I'm, I'm, st I'm still curious on what the hell. But if you guys have ideas, let me know down in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button like a boss. And I'll see you guys next time around. And if you're new to my channel, pl um, pl press the bell icon to get newly updates on my videos. Thank you. Bye-bye. Mm-hmm.